Hello, today we're going to talk about how to recover a job. So if this works in a few scenarios, so if you've forgotten to save the job, so you've gone to another job but you forgot to save it, this will recover it. And then another way uh, is if you accidentally uh, did, did something in the job and then saved it and you've overwritten the job that you had, and now you want to go back, this is a way to save that and recover it. So Mosaic's got a good handful of ways to save your job backups, but it's not, it's not evident at all unless you know about this trick. So if you look in your jobs folder and go to the certain jobs that you have, it'll tell you all these files kind of have a certain, uh, a certain job. So this lock file locks other people from opening it. These room files are everything. This is the everything from this room is stored in these room files. Room zero is nothing. Disregards room zero. It's not relevant to anything. It all starts at room one and goes up from there. And it's not name. You you can name it here something else, and it will still be room one. It's referenced by this number right here. So if you have room like you have five different rooms and the fourth room is named ensuite bathroom or something and it's got a number five here or whatever this would be under room five so down here would be room five so if you're trying to save the data from that room you have to find room five in this case we're just going to do room one which is just a kitchen we've drawn up a, a while ago and we're going to show you how this works so this right here the dot des file or the des design file is what it is uh, is the one that mosaic is currently grabbing it's currently picking up the design file it always picks up the design files and every i think 10 minutes or 15 minutes it will save your work what you're working on into this file so that saves you as the backup file and then 10 minutes later so BAK backup file. And then 10 minutes later, when it saves this again, it'll dump this one into this secondary backup file. So SBK. So you get basically two chances to try and save data that you've worked on. And I'm pretty sure it's every 10 minutes. As you can see, when I open the job, it's already saved one. As I'm recording this, it's uh, 1 10 p.m. on May 13th. So it's already saved one in a backup file. Now, this is the main one, which it obviously hasn't changed because that's the one that it's going to pick up here. So let's just say I've accidentally deleted this. Oh no, I've deleted a bunch of parts. And I'm going to save it. So now you can see in my jobs right here, room one, it's now saved it as of this time right here. So in order to save that, I want to bring it back. So let's close it. Okay. So if I want to bring back that old version, because I accidentally overwritten that file, all you have to do is take this dot back file and re rename it the dot design file so you're going to take this i usually save these somewhere so i'm going to cut and i'll just create a new folder in here called i don't know backup and i'm going to paste it in here so now mosaic has no room for that file so you go to your first backup. This one here obviously is still the very original one. So let's just, for, you want to rename this and you want to make sure also that it's showing the, um, the extension. And I'll show you how to do that shortly. Well, maybe I should show you how to do that right now. So what you want to do is go to control panel which is settings. You want to go to folders. So 
you can go to file explorer options and then we go here so this brings up this menu and then what you want to do is you want to search for uh, anything that says has to do with the file extensions this one hides the file extensions for known file types let's deselect that uh, and if there's any other ones that say show file extension deselect it Let's see where are you Yeah, so it's this one right here, uh, hide extensions. If that one's selected and it's a known file type, which if it's set in Windows, it will show it. If it's not shown, it won't show it. So let's go back here. Oh, I got to save that. So go there, apply, OK. So you can see now every extension is shown. So this is a .des file. So what you want to do is you want to go to your room one backup. You want to remove the file extension and put des at the end that's going to overwrite it yet you want to click yes now if you go into mosaic and i open up this bowl and barb job it will show you the original one uh, bowl and barb And you can see it's saved all of the data here. There is another optional back uh, way to back up too, which is kind of nice. If you have OneDrive, um, I'm not going to go into that part, but if you go, if you have OneDrive and you log into your OneDrive, so for instance, we're saving all our files on our OneDrive. If you log into OneDrive in a web browser and you right click on the file, it will say show something along the lines of show previous backups or previous files and that will give you another option uh, to save a few there's a few other uh, save options in there this here will pretty much save you nine times out of ten so as long as you know this then you're pretty much golden it, if you have if this one didn't work where your BAK file didn't work then you delete this one or move it into a backup and then try your secondary SBK and that's another uh, option to try and save it but it's basically just saving it each time every 10 minutes so that should help you out and uh thanks for watching that's about it for now